My work is sort of in between the world of art and graphic novels. I make books and I draw and I make props. I'm very narrative and story based. At first, when I got here, I felt very out of place. I think that most people do when they start a degree program, but I started to look at story like a more conceptual and even 3D way. So that was incredibly difficult for me as someone that's not very good at 3D. <laughs> How do you read a story? And does it have to be in a book? And I think what I came to in the end was a combination of books and also different kinds of stories that you could read in different kinds of ways. So I had this series of small paintings that you could sort of read, I mean, in any direction. So I really just sort of zoomed out my perspective of what a story looks like. I never knew what to do when I first got into the studio every morning. I just didn't know, like, where do you start? It sounds so simple, but CG has helped me. I've, I now have a process and a routine for that. As rigorous and serious as our program is and really founded in theory and history, I'm leaving with a, a more playful and lighthearted perspective of art in general and in my work. And I've, I've found the joy that I used to have when I was a kid.